Most of you probably already know that the universe is very big. So big that if we took a break from our everyday lives and just thought about how big everything is, we'd probably go crazy. Because of this, most of us don't think about anything outside our local environment. Our brains just aren't made to handle such thoughts. If we think about it, like scientists, astronomers, and stoned college students do, we'd understand that the universe is full of scary things that you wouldn't find in a children's book. If we went to its darker parts, we'd find that it has a lot of interesting and troubling secrets we haven't found yet. Let's see the 10 scariest things in the universe. Number 10. The Higgs Boson Doomsday Depending on where you are in the world, there are many different end-of-the-world situations. Many cultures think that the end of the world will be exciting, which is fine with us as long as we get to see some cool pictures. But the most dangerous and likely doomsday scenarios come from real experts. And one of them is the Higgs boson doomsday. Many of them, including Stephen Hawking, think it could happen or has already happened. It would start with a bubble full of changing Higgs energy which must stay the same for the universe to be stable. The bubble would grow like a vacuum, changing the way atoms work, and in some cases, breaking them apart. Some experts think that it has already started, and that we will soon be leaving the dark parts of the universe behind. Others say that it will happen a long time from now, and that by then, we may already be long gone. Number 9. Galactic Cannibalism Even though cannibalism in general is gross, the last thing we want to hear about is cannibalism in space. It's scary to think that some bigger galaxies are eating smaller ones, and that it could happen to us. But you don't have to worry because it won't happen anytime soon. On the other hand, many smaller galaxies are being eaten by a bigger one because it had nothing else to do that day. Also, it's not too far from us. Andromeda, which is the most well-known galaxy and part of our local group, ate a Milky Way sister galaxy about 2 billion years ago. It is expected to do the same thing with the Milky Way in about 4.5 billion years. But by then, people should have learned how to travel between galaxies or have died out. Those who decide to stay will get to see a beautiful light show. Number 8. The Outcast Supermassive Black Hole if we knew everything that was going on in the universe, our lives might not seem so important. On the other hand, some of these things are so big that they really show how small we are. One of them is an enormous black hole that was kicked out of the galaxy. Scientists found out that it would take as much energy as 100 million supernovas to send a black hole into space. It's not just any black hole either. It's by far the biggest black hole we've ever seen moving. The energy came from the merging of two black holes at the heart of the galaxy, which happens all the time in space. Number 7. Rogue Black Holes A black hole seems to be the most dangerous rogue entity that we can think of. We all know that black holes are areas of space that are so full of matter they have such strong gravitational forces that even light can't get out of them. You should try to stay away from them because they eat everything in their gravity field. But it becomes a problem when it starts to move. Like everything else in the universe, black holes can find their own paths. In some cases, they start moving so fast that they eat everything in their way. A black hole the size of Jupiter is currently speeding across the Milky Way. So this is not a distant event. It was thought to be still in the past, but a new study shows that it is not. Number 6. Zombie Stars Everything that is living will die someday, and this includes everything in the universe. You may remember from science class that the death of a star is one of the most interesting things that can happen in the known universe. Every star we can see in the sky, including our own sun, has already died or will die at some point in the future. That is the way things should go, unless they decide not to. Stars can sometimes die and then come back to life as if nothing happened, which confuses both us and science. They just found zombie stars that should have died when they went supernova, but didn't, and are now speeding through space with a new sense of life and excitement. We don't understand them, so we don't want them near us. 
Number 5. Galaxies Without Dark Matter If you've spent any time on the internet or in science groups, you know that the visible universe is only a small part of the whole. A substance called dark matter makes up most of the universe. We could have given it a more technical name, but since we don't know much about it, dark matter is the best way to describe what we think it is. We know it's everywhere and makes up huge parts of the universe. But that's about it. On the other hand, the galaxy without dark matter is even stranger. Before, it was thought that whatever dark matter is, the universe needs it to hold everything together. This galaxy, and others like it, show that galaxies don't need dark matter to stay together. This makes the mystery even bigger. Number 4. The Triple Galaxy Collision No matter what is going on in our lives, we can take comfort in the fact that there is always something interesting happening in the world. It's not a dull place at all, with great light shows and stars that are going out. Some of these events, on the other hand, are so huge that we'd rather be bored or on a quiet afternoon on Earth than anywhere near them. One of these is the 2007 discovery of the strange crash of three galaxies. Even though two galaxies meet more often than you might think, it is rare for three to do so. In the photos, what looks like a ball of light is actually three big groups of stars that are coming together and making new stars quickly. About 200 solar masses per year at the center. Number 3. The Mystery of the Biggest Black Hole Ever Found we don't know much about the universe, but that's okay because we can't know everything. Still, it's a big disappointment to think we've solved a problem only to find out later that we haven't. Think about the biggest and brightest black hole ever found in the early universe. It's in the middle of a quasar, which is a bright, big object with a black hole at its center. Astronomers just found out about this object. It is called SDSS J0100-2802 and it's as bright as 420 trillion suns. It is also by far the biggest quasar that has ever been found. We don't know how it started because nothing in the early universe should have gotten so big. This makes it the most mysterious black hole that we know of. Number 2. The Coldest Place in the Universe The sky is pretty cold because only a small part of it is warmed by the heat of stars. We know it's cold outside, but we don't know how cold it can get. Some scientists say that the Boomerang Nebula is the coldest place in the whole known universe. A nebula is a large cloud of gas and dust in space. It's so cold, on average, negative 457.87 degrees Fahrenheit, that experts have been trying for a long time to figure out what happened to it. A new study says that there's a perfectly good reason for this. It was thrown out when a star in its last stages of life crashed into a bigger star, causing most of its matter to be thrown out in a cold burst. Even though it's too far away to be dangerous now, we should all agree not to go there if we ever learn how to move between galaxies. Number 1. Strange Matter You might not think that something called strange stuff would be important. It sounds like something scientists made up when they couldn't explain something and wish to remember it. If you look it up online, you'll see that it's by far one of the weirdest parts of theoretical physics. Strange matter, which could be made up of many different particles, is different from anything we've seen before. Normal matter is made up of atoms, each of which has a center with protons and neutrons. They are made up of quarks, which stay neatly packed together and give everything its own unique qualities. On the other hand, it seems like the quarks have no limits or rules about what they should do. It's a different kind of substance, and the scary thing about it is that it could change everything it touches into its own traits. Yes, a tiny piece of strange matter from anywhere in the universe could be on its way here right now and change a lot of the things around it, or even destroy them. Thanks for watching.